I am here with this Super Monsters box. I want to thank Hasbro for sending this to me to open up with you guys today. Super Monsters is a show on Netflix and now there are toys. I'm so excited. This box is super cute, but let's go ahead and open up this box. All right, you guys, let's open this up. Whoa, look. Look, so they have their normal form out here, and then inside they have their monster form. What? This is, this is so cool. We have plushies. We have a bus. We have two figures, and we have this scepter there. So let's go ahead and start opening all of this stuff up. Before we jump into the toys, let's meet the characters. Just to let you know, Netflix has seasons one and two streaming now, so make sure you check it out if you haven't. It looks so cool. So super cute. I love the concept, the little monsters and their monster parents. But let's start. It says, welcome to the world of super monsters, where the descendants of the most famous monsters are learning to control their powers. And it says, sun down, monsters up each night. The school the students at Pitchfork Pines Preschool transform into their monster selves and learn to become the best monsters and people they can be. So the first one we have here is... A Oh, she's a little, okay. An impulsive young witch, Katya's spelling is always ready to lend a helping wand. She loves to practice her spells, though they often don't go as planned. So that's her human form and her monster form. Then we have Lobo Howler. A talkative little werewolf with the superpower of super speed, Lobo Howler is always on the go, go, go. <laughs> I love his little forms. They're all so cute. They're all so cute, but I love the little werewolf form. Then we have clever, kind, and incredibly creative. Zoe Walker is an artistic young zombie who can see through and walk through walls. That's cool. I like her dress. Prone to unintentionally destructive temper tantrums, Frankie Mash is, at his heart, really just a good mini Frankenstein monster with super strength, of course. <laughs> Oh, so cute. And then we have Cleo Graves. Cleo Graves is an adorably self-absorbed mummy with the power to control the wind. Ooh. Then we have fearless, funny, and incredibly charming Drax Shadows loves to practice his flying skills. A natural leader, he's also a bit of a show-off. Oh, it looks like we're on our last characters. The youngest of the super monsters, Spike Gong, is chatty and excitable dragon with an over or sorry with control over water and the ability to make clouds. That's really cool. Then we have Igor and Esme. Esme. Igor Foster and his granddaughter are the two best and only teachers at Pitchfork Pines Preschool. Together with the Gerbus, the monster. Together with Gerbus, the monster bus, they help the super monsters learn important lessons, explore pitchfork pines, and enjoy magical adventures. All right, guys, we have so much stuff to take a look at. I think we should start with the plushies. This one's so super cute. I love the plushies. I think this is something that I might collect, like, all the whole series of, because they're just so cute in their little monster form. Look at little Frankie. They even say it on who they are on the tag. So Frankie Mash here. That would be really cool if they also made their human forms. I don't know if they will, but like human form and plushie as well would be really, really cute. But here we go. Let's see if anything's on the inside. Nothing on the inside of the tag. He's really, really soft, you guys. Really soft. All of the green that you see, all of the brown. This shirt isn't as soft, but it's still fabric. And he's just a big plushie. And he has all embroidery here. And look at his stitches. They're all embroidered. His eyes are completely embroidered. Same with the mouth. So amazing. And same with her. So much detail. This bracelet is all embroidered. And we have the eyes, the eyebrows, the nose, the mouth, all embroidered. And her hair is pretty crazy cool. Uh, it's not stuffed in here. These are kind of just flaps of fabric. That's super cool. And I like her little splattery dress. She's so stuffy and amazing. I love these guys. Let me kind of just set them off to the side. And we have a scepter to try out. Now this is, this is, this is going to be interesting. So I guess we should try it. Time for some magic. 
Those are the phrases it seems to have. I don't know if it'll have more if we take it out. So let me go ahead and take it out and I'll be right back. I took this wand out of the package and it's saying the same stuff. I mean, there's no switch or anything. Usually there's like a try me and then on and off and I thought that might be the case, but it's not. It's just saying the same phrases over and over. Now this is Katya's spelling magic wand, by the way. I thought it was just general. Nope, it's it's hers. It's so cool. I love the, the um, butterflies on here and I love how this lights up here and it's shimmery and it's just so pretty. Now we have figures, which I'm so stoked for. Do they have their names on the figures? They should. Yes, they do. Cleo and Katya here. So this is her magic wand over there. It's a little bit on the on the big side for this size figure. No, I'm just kidding. Collect them all. So these are all of the ones you can get. That's really, really awesome. I would really like the human form as well, to be quite honest. I think they're really cute. But let's go ahead and get these guys or these girls girls, or these monsters, I guess I should say, out of the box here. Let's get the first one. So I'm wondering if they're going to have different backgrounds. No, they're about the same. They're the same. But you have this, like, this background right there. Set that off the side. And let's get her out of here. Oh, she hooked in. That's why. I was like, why aren't you coming out of there? She is we go she's out she's out we have her she's really cute I love all of the detail on these figures they're so gorgeous and something I just noticed just now like in this moment they will fit in this bus like we don't need a special size figure for the monster bus there this is literally the size figure and I really like that about these now we have the hands moving or the arms moving and the head even moves see that's really awesome. Oh my gosh, I'm freaking out. The details is just so amazing. Just all of these details. And then let's get um, Cleo out of her box. And it looks like in the Gur bus, the Gur monster bus, Gur bus monster bus, we get our little werewolf buddy. I wonder if we can purchase him separately. So we get him in the bus. So I'm very curious to see if we'll get him separately. Now let's get this gorgeous one out of the pack. <laughs> Look at this gold cat at the top. It looks so awesome. And I love her mummy bandages. It's so perfect. And her cape is kind of like a little rubbery, so it kind of you can move it a little bit. Now she does have arms that move. They're in kind of that like mummy position, you know? <laughs> so you can have it bend weird if you want it to. And then her head moves. So awesome. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and get the monster bus out of the pack. Here is the figure we get inside. Again, his arms move and his head moves. Awesome, he looks so good. Look at all this fur detail too. So amazing. Now for the bus. The bus is what we've all been waiting for. <laughs> it looks so cool, it has eyes. Whoa, sorry. Because it is Gur, Gur the monster bus. Um, Gur bus, Gur bus the monster bus. <laughs> He's so cool. Anyway, we have little fangs here as well. This is a button we'll press in just a moment. This does require batteries, but I have installed them and the batteries will go right here. They do come with ammo batteries, by the way. Now, we don't have any door or anything. I mean, we have a fake door right here. This, by the way, does wheel. Um, it comes open up here. Look at that. It has wings, it's like a bat, it's flying away, and you can put, or a dragon, or you know, something like that. Anyway, you put your little people in there and drive away, but let's go ahead and put some people in here. Let's put all of the friends that we have in here. It's a little slippery, I kind of wish they had some seats or something, kind of just a stand, just stand, <laughs> and then we press the button. Is that lighting up, by the way? Okay, we'll, we 
we've circled the we've circled we're back to some of the ones we've seen heard before not seen before anyway i really really like the wings they're so cool and i love the detail of the bus i love the wheels i just love how it's just gerbus he's so cool i love his eyes how they light up i think that's so super neat Click the card on the screen to watch more videos like this one. Be sure to subscribe and I will see you next time.